Excuse me. Excuse me. You can't park there. What do you mean I can't park here? You can't park here. There's a chair in that parking spot for a reason. What are you talking about? You can't have a parking spot with a plastic chair. The street is owned by the city. No Let me guess. A parking? Let me guess. You're from the suburbs. Yeah, I'm Wexford. Yeah, you don't come into the city much, do you? Well, no, not that often. My daughter lives down on the south side. Now we're just going to lunch and... Yeah, 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 I don't care. The rule in the city is if I put a chair in a parking spot, the parking space is mine. End of story, bro. You gotta scram. That's ridiculous. Man, whatever, dude, but I don't make the rules. I shovel the spot, I put the chair there, ipso facto, the spot is mine. Well, what happens if I move the chair and park there anywhere? <laughs> you don't want to do that. Oh no? Why not? If you move the chair, then street justice dictates. I get to smash your taillights and crap into your gas tank. Wait, what? That's right. You get to smash my taillights and crap in my tank. Well, technically, I don't get the crap in your in your gas tank. That's just my kind of thing, you know, my calling card. Well, well, if you do that, I'll just call the cops. Go ahead, they'll just laugh at you. Ball's on my side, sir. I shoveled it out. I live here. I placed a plastic chair in the spot. You park there. Say goodbye to your taillights and fish out. Float her out of your carburetor. What? Did you really do that? Yep. And I just ate a fathead, too. So you're going to need a tow truck. Triple A. I mean, a big tow truck we're talking well, let me ask you something. If you're in your house, where's your car? I don't have a car. Wait a minute. You don't even have a car? Nope, but I will soon. What, you bought one? No. I pulled a folded chair on top of that Jeep Cherokee down the street down there, and when the owner comes out, well, I'm going to break the bad news to him. My chair, my car. Street justice. You got to keep your head on a swivel, Jack. Are you crazy? You don't have the right. You don't have the right to you come just because you put a plastic chair on it. Well, you know, it goes all the way back to Andrew Carnegie, dude. He forged steel chairs to leave them on prime real estate so no one else could claim it. Then he would build another steel mill on the land where he would make... Chairs? Exactly. The man was a certifiable genius. Hey, is that your daughter? Yes, it is. Wow. Hey, hold on a second, dude. I'm going to get another chair. <laughs>